Hey, what's going on you guys? Sorry for the lack of vlog update yesterday. Um, and today is just going to be another short one too. I know I've been on like a really long string of short vlog posts. But today's vlog post actually has a message. Um, and I'm going to discuss uh, gas. You know, So if you're not a photographer, you might not know what the hell I'm talking about. But it's an acronym for Gear Acquisition Syndrome. And basically that's just, you know, this... Um, this mindset that you always need to get the next new piece of gear in order to be a better photographer you know i know people who chase down the latest lens thinking that oh man you know if i get this 75 millimeter f 1.8 you know it's going to launch my photography to the next level and it's not really how it works you know you can't just throw a new piece of glass on a camera get a new body and just be a better photographer but I do believe that if your mind is in the right place um, as a creative person that getting a new piece of gear can inspire you to create better work or inspire you to be more creative. Um, I actually use something along those lines as like my Twitter quote or tagline or whatever, you know, you know, and I'm constantly amazed at how getting a new piece of gear drives me to be more creative. It doesn't make me a better photographer per se, but it just inspires me to create better. Um, take for instance, the 300 millimeter F4 that I've been shooting with, you know, um, I've shot bird photos dozens of times over the years, you know, but getting a piece of equipment of that caliber, that quality, um, that is capable of resolving such great detail it really made me focus on making better shots, um, making sure that the eye on the bird that I'm shooting is sharp, making sure that I have enough contrast in the scene so that you can make out detail in the feathers. Whereas before, you know, with a mediocre lens, I was happy to just reach out and shoot the bird, you know, and I think that I have this renewed sense of inspiration by having a different piece of equipment that is driving me to make better bird photos. And the same goes with any time I get a piece of equipment, you know, I'm inspired to create something that much better with it, you know, than I've been doing with previous gear. Um, and that leads me to the TG Tracker, the camera that Olympus announced the other day. It's a, uh, it's a sports or adventure camera, you know, that you can take hiking and biking and kayaking and skydiving and you name it you know any kind of adventure sport or you can use it for doing this right here what i'm doing vlogging you know I, i'm hoping that you know it makes my vlogging easier and inspires me to do better with my vlogging so i'm really looking forward to getting a hold of the tg tracker and not only vlogging with it but maybe being able to use some of the features that come with that camera to enhance my vlog by being able to provide interesting information so if i'm say storm chasing with the tracker um, and one of the features is you can log like barometric pressure so i could show uh, barometric pressure changes as i you know am a, you know chasing down a storm you know or temperature fluctuations things like that you know g-forces if i'm driving like an idiot trying to chase down the storm i mean there's all these sensors in that camera and I'm just, my brain is just reeling with the possibilities of things that I can use those for. And it's not that it's going to make me better at vlogging or better at shooting video. But it's going to inspire me to create something that I haven't done before. So, I guess my message for today is don't chase down that piece of gear because you think it's going to make you better. Chase down that piece of gear if it's going to inspire you to create better. <laughs> I'm going to kill the camera because the crazy cat uh, cat lady neighbor is out talking to her dogs and whatever. <laughs> you guys take care. I got some bags to pack. I'm headed up to the camper tomorrow afternoon, heading up bright and early. Well, about 11.30. I'm heading up, pick up my kids and head north. Going to do some birding and I am for sure bringing you on a sunset chase in Grand Haven, Michigan on the pier. Love you guys. Take care. Have a safe and happy holiday weekend. And don't forget what Memorial Day is all about. It's not about a three-day weekend. It's about remembering those who served and sacrificed for the United States. 
And if you don't live in the United States, I guess that doesn't apply to you. But still, take care, you guys. See ya.